I've had a studio at Wimbledon now for three and a half years. Just a great community here of sort of like-minded people where you swap ideas and uh, sometimes collaborate with other people. I'm Eden Eustace and this is my studio. In my early years I did um, a lot of, well, mostly figurative painting, uh, watercolours, oils, a lot of drawing. I've always liked drawing. So from that and looking at artists like Roger Hilton, Sandra Blow and Richard Diebenkorn, who was a huge influence, and of course Munch, who was a massive influence from an early age. I am constantly influenced by the Norwegian landscape all the time in my work and when I go over there I draw, I take photographs. I use a lot of drawing in my uh, painting and I sometimes draw and paint at the same time uh, whereas I might draw with my left with say a piece of charcoal or a graphite stick and include that in the structure of the painting and paint at the same time or draw a little bit and paint a little bit but mainly with oils at the moment um, and I'm quite enjoying it and I'm working on different surfaces as well and it's become simpler as I'm getting older it's, it's becoming a lot simpler my work so you know it's, it's quite hard to do being simple I'm working on this one at the moment but these ones are more or less finished and it's a diptych in tribute to my late sister. And the year before she died, we took the children to the beach and it was a beautiful day. And what I've tried to do with the white is to build up the texture of the sea. You can see it here. That's kind of the horizon coming in here. And you can see the waves here, a bit of writing here. Same thing on the other side. So basically I think what I did was I made her one and I made myself one. When I finished this series of white paintings that I'm going to go quite bright. So I did these little drawings and thought I'd just have a few kind of tester panels and see how kind of like an abstract piece but working from um, uh, a piece of a scenery from, from Norway. So this is kind of like a, a tree here, abstracted with a lake and the sort of mountains in the background there. So this is, I do a lot from memory, but sketching as well. So this would be um, a memory from childhood that I would remember and the sun coming up on the horizon kind of thing at one o'clock in the morning. <laughs> I've been uh, kind of been motivated by life really and just being well in life motivates me to paint. You don't choose art, it chooses you. It, it's, you know, something that I've always had in me. So when I get up in the morning I go, yep, studio day, got to go in, produce some work. If you don't produce work, you don't sell. So, yeah, it's good. I wouldn't do anything else really.